This was terrifying for a couple who'd just become the owners of a new puppy. Surveillance video shows the moment police worked to save the choking dog. Those officers jumped into action and they performed CPR for several minutes. And amazingly, it worked. That puppy is now on the mend tonight. She was, help, help me, help me, help me. Uh, my dog had swallowed something. I don't know what's going on. Officer Jorge Hernandez is not used to emergencies bursting into the police station. But on Sunday, a frantic couple rushed in with their St. Bernard puppy who couldn't breathe. Put the dog down on the floor and, um, I mean, my whole hands pretty much wrapped around him and I just started... Uh, kind of pumping away on his chest. He was hoping his modified Heimlich maneuver could clear the puppy's airway. And I finally kind of heard a kind of like a puff of air come out um, and we just kept doing that for about I'd say a, a minute or two. That's when the police tag teamed with North Reading firefighters. Once he started you know getting some oxygen he started to come around a little bit more and uh, you know, perked up a lot. These first responders say you do what you can to save any life. I would say it's more instinct and training uh, than anything else. We are not trained in, uh, in, you know, in dog care, per se. But some techniques you save for humans. All we had was some foam in the mouth coming out, and you don't really want to do mouth to snout on and that's up. What are we going to do, I guess, you know? After all, this was a case of professional courtesy. St. Bernard, which is normally, you know, uh, known for their history of saving people, the other day was kind of our way of uh, saving, saving the breed ourselves. The puppy is recovering at the vet tonight. The couple, by the way, just got the puppy the day before. That's some great work yeah. right there. Mouth to snout, very effective. Mouth to snout. <laughs> and the CPR. They have those cold little noses, too. That's right. Laddie's right. okay.